You're watching a video produced from Sandridge Energy Studios at Opubco. Oklahoma's gaming industry continues its growth. The Call Nation is planning to open a totally smoke-free casino this spring at its tribal headquarters in Call City. Meanwhile, Oklahoma Indian Gaming produced over $3.4 billion in revenues in 2011. That's a 7.7 percent increase over the previous year. The Oklahoman's Randy Ellis reports Oklahoma's 2011 Indian gaming revenue growth rate was more than double the 3.4 percent nationally. This is according to the 2013 edition of Casino City's Indian Gaming Industry Report. Nationally, Indian gaming generated over $27.4 billion in 2011. Now also, Oklahoma tribes generated over $493 million in non-gaming revenue from guests. We're talking food, beverages, lodging, shopping, and entertainment, and that's up 7.9% over the previous year. Nationwide, six large casinos opened in 2011, including two right here in Oklahoma. The Thunderbird Casino Shawnee, operated by the absentee Shawnee Tribe of Oklahoma with 254 machines, and the Golden Eagle Casino in Apache, operated by the Apache Tribe of Oklahoma with 240 machines. One last note, Casino City's report noted that Oklahoma tribes decreased the number of their table games in their casinos in 2011 and decreased the percentage of Class 3 games while increasing the percentage of Class 2 games. What does that mean? Well, it led to the amount of fees the state received in 2010 from tribal compact fees actually decreasing from $122.7 million to $121.7 million in 2011. Read more on Randy Ellis' story in the Oklahoman and online at NewsOK.com.